uh, in this video we'll be studying about discharging of capacitor okay or you can say decay of charge okay of charge means see in the first case we have charged a capacitor okay it is fully charged now there is a decay of charge or you can say discharging of the capacitor okay uh, before that uh, let me uh, do one problem okay on growth of charge i'm giving you one problem just try to do it this is a capacitor c okay battery uh, just a second which f okay. now you need to find find you need to find i just after after pressing the key okay. i okay Just after pressing the key, okay. This is a key, okay. Switch. Second case, long after pressing the key and charge on the capstone. Pause the video for two minutes and try to do this problem, okay. Now, <coughs> solution. The first case, just after pressing the key. Okay, what will happen when we uh, are joining uh, the key? The current I will flow. Okay, this will pass through here. Okay, what will happen? Just after pressing the key, this capacitor, this will be start to charge. Means this will be charging. So remember one thing when the capacitor starts charging okay just after pressing the key this capacitor will behave as a conducting wire means our modified circuit will be like this right means there will not be any current which which will be flowing through this resistor to R right I will be the uh, applied potential E upon the resistor here in the first case okay in the second case long after pressing the key lo long after pressing the key means the capacitor is charged okay now when the capacitor gets charged this will not be receiving any current means the capacitor will behave as open circuit means the current will come from here and pass through the resistor to R. there will not be any current going through this circuit or this side okay so i will be e upon 3r plus 2r that means e by 5r right now in the third case a charge on the capacitor okay in the third case uh, the charge will be uh, what will charge charge will be q is equal to c into the potential difference that is applied across the resistor or sorry across the capacitor third case okay it will be c let's say this is our circuit okay If you consider this point as A, point as B, okay. Now, what will be the current? Uh, what will be the potential difference across A and B? It will be I into R, okay. What is I? I is basically this one, right? 
the capture is being charged okay uh, we need to calculate what will the charge on capture okay so i is e upon 5r and your resistor is this 2r into 2r r gets cancelled out this means 2e by 5 this will be your va minus vb minus means the potential difference cos capture okay so the charge will be q equal to c into va minus vb means c into 2e by 5 means 2 t e upon 5 this will be your charge on the capacitor which is being uh, joined in the circuit now coming on to our topic uh, we need to study dk of charge okay so i am drawing this simple circuit okay now we are joining this the capacitor is being charged okay now there will be a dk of charge okay suppose the potential at across capacitor is c and across resistor is r okay now when the switch s is connected uh, to b capacitor will start to discharge so at t equal to 0 meant at initial time means when we are starting to observe this okay at that instant q dot is equal to c e means the charge on the capacitor is c e okay and at t equal to t the charge will be zero means the capacitor when the capacitor is fully discharged right so <coughs> applying kvl across this loop okay what will be the equation q upon c minus i into r equal to zero that means q upon c is equal to i into r okay now q upon c i can be written as dq by dt into r so i rearrange this equation okay uh, put the dq on the q side so it will be q upon uh, sorry uh, it will be dq upon q and this will be dt upon c r equal to dq upon q now when we are uh, starting to analyze this circuit at that instant equal to zero okay and uh, the range was t of uh, the range of t was from zero to t so this upper limit will be t and at the instant t equal to zero what was the charge on the capacitor it was q naught and at t equal to t charge is q okay uh, just a second i think this is a wrong value at at t equal to t charge is q okay now you just need to integrate this okay very simple equation this will be t upon c r is equal to ln of q right i think uh, we have done one mistake here uh, this dq by dt it will be negative okay why so because there is a dk of charge right the charge is actually decreasing so this will be a negative okay minus dq by dt this will be minus dq by dt okay uh, now coming on to our topic uh, this will be ln of q the charge is varying from q naught to q so uh, on putting the limits you will get ln of q minus ln of q naught equal to minus t upon c r so from here you will get q upon q naught equal to minus t upon c r q equal to q naught e to power minus t upon c r okay this is our instantaneous charge on the capture at any instant okay. similarly you can calculate current as well this will be e q upon dt so on differentiating that it will be q naught upon c r e to the power minus t upon c r okay so this will be minus e upon r e to the power minus t by c r uh, why we have uh, written is i will be minus e q by dt right so this will be or you can say the modulus value will be 
माइनस टी अपॉन टी आर राइट दिस इज और करेंट करेंट एट एन इंस्टेंट वॉट विल बी और पोटेंशियल अक्रॉस कैप्चर इट विल बी वी सी इक्वल टू क्यू बाई सी तो ऑन पुटिंग दिस वैल्यू यू विल गेट वी सी एंड ऑन पुटिंग वी आर आई इन टू आर यू विल गेट पोटेंशियल अक्रॉस ओके सो दिस वॉज रिजल्ट ऑफ डी क्यू ऑफ चार्ज ओके आई होप ऑन यू है दिस प्रॉब्लम एज वॉल ओके and try to solve uh problem on dq of charge as well